you get a reality check and you come back into the real world about all the stupid shit that you have been thinking and maybe said like and it just all hits you at once while that's happening right now to me i was going off my house i don't even know why i said this now i was talking about i was gonna blow up the renting office i was gonna blow up some office i'm like why why did i say that i was just going off for no reason and i feel so stupid now about the things that i said but i guess in that moment it made sense because i was being influenced by i don't know evil or dumb shit but now i'm back outside i'm back in the real world and shit and i'm thinking like that shit that i said was so stupid (laughs) why did i say that why did i think that why did i think that thing is when you, you you're like cooped up and you have those weird ass paranoid thoughts you mean like it's like a 50 50 thing half of it could be true and the other half is wrong i'm back out here and i'm seeing all the shit that was probably wrong about what i thought that's why uh, you gotta forgive yourself and uh have a renewal of mind like come out in spaces like this like what the fuck was I talking about? I talked I said so much shit. I was being pretty paranoid, I'm not gonna lie. Oh no, Lord forgive me. I feel bad about it. I was said I was I said I was gonna blow up the renting office. And I was gonna blow up somebody else's office that was in the building. So I was saying I was gonna shoot up places dumb shit that could have gotten me arrested if somebody if the right person would have actually heard it actually but nobody took me seriously anyway <laughs> thankfully but like that was so stupid Ooh, it's, it's these these orange breast bird i don't even know what the hell you call them i see these birds a lot sometimes around here but yes but you know i felt drawn to just sit on a rock right now because i feel like i need to get grounded Because when you're in in your mind, you're overthinking, and you're going through these negative anxiety cycles of thought, cyclical thought patterns, you're not grounded, you're not in your present, you're not present, you're not really being in your body. And um, what the enemy does is they, they, he uses your mind to destroy you, you know. So we really got to come out of that and be grounded, which is something that they were trying to teach me in therapy when I still had a good therapist. The person I have now is just some 